What's up, Disc Maniacs? Today, I'm gonna to show you how to get maximum distance. Practice these key form tips to improve your distance out on the course. Distance on tour is becoming more and more crucial, so if you want birdie opportunities, you need to elevate your distance, so I'm gonna help you with that. So let's go out to the field and get going. To cultivate maximum distance, I like to think of it from the ground up. My first tip is to start with footwork. One of the key components to throwing maximum distance is planting your foot perpendicular to the line you are throwing. By planting your foot perpendicular, it allows you to use your lower body for maximum efficiency. Once we established our perpendicular plant foot, I like to think about my reach back, but not necessarily a reach back. I think a good way to think about it is more of pushing your arm out away from you because a reach back, you can twist your upper body too much and that will cause bad rounding. Pushing your arm straight out away from you is gonna allow you to get a nice clean pull through away from your body to help you find that power pocket. Now we are in our throwing position. We're ready to rip this shot. So for tip number three, it's thinking about the pull through across your body. You wanna think about bringing it as close to your chest as possible and leading with your elbow. The elbow is gonna be a great guide to help you with accuracy and help with timing. For tip number four, it's the follow through as well as angle integrity. Last tip was pulling across your chest, leading with your elbow. As you come into the hit point of the throw, you want to really emphasize a clean follow through, throw through your shot so you're able to swing your arm around to enable a clean release. It's gonna minimize injuries. But also, if you're throwing a flat shot, think about releasing on a flat angle and throwing that flat angle through the entirety of your follow through. That's angle integrity. Same if you're throwing a hyzer coming from low, ending high. If you're throwing an anhyzer coming low, ending low. By focusing on the follow through as well as angle integrity, it'll help improve the consistency as well as the longevity of your disc golf career. My last tip, tip number five, is about grip and wrist positioning. I like a power grip. The way I find my power grip is I roll the disc into my hand and put all four fingers underneath the bottom side of the disc, pressing somewhat firmly, probably about 75% power, with my thumb pressing also at about 75% power on the top flight plate. I don't like my thumb to be too far out or too far in, just find what is comfortable for you. And the way my wrist is positioned, I like it to be nice and straight. I don't like to curl it because I believe that this is just going to slow your shot down. You wanna think of the head of a whip, just a quick little release. Keeping my wrist straight allows a quick release out of my hand to eject the disc cleanly. When I'm out on tour and need a dependable maximum distance, I'm going with my new Horizon Cloud Breaker. I love the way these came out. The Cloud Breaker is a unique mold that I co-designed with Disc Mania last year. These are on the more overstable side of the Cloud Breaker. It's a 12-speed wide rim driver that I can depend on, and that's what makes it the ultimate distance driver. One last thing, I wanna recap the five tips I just gave you guys. First. Plant your foot perpendicular, at least 90 degrees. Reach your arm out away from you. Bring your arm across your chest, leading with your elbow, thinking about your follow through and angle integrity. And lastly, the grip. Nice firm grip, evenly spaced out with a straight wrist. Let's rip some drives. Oh yeah. All 
right guys, those are my tips for maximum distance. I recommend you coming out to a field and trying these out rather than out on the course so you can come up with your own winning distance formula. And if you're interested in unlocking your maximum distance potential, check out the new Horizon Cloud Raker. They're the ultimate distance driver. They'll become available on the Discmania store or at your favorite local retailer. I really appreciate the support guys. Until next time, keep on dreaming, peace.